That's right. We are now in Berlin with my tuba, and that's because I uh, won the uh, uh, Rising Stars competition, and uh, selected winners are allowed to play in the Philharmonie Berlin, and I'm one of uh, these, I'm one of the lucky ones, and uh, I'm very happy about that. And um, I arrived today, and I'm gonna play tomorrow, and I thought. Uh, why not use this as a chance to uh, record it and vlog it and actually tell you guys about how it is to travel with tuba? We had to wait at security because uh, it was very full. That didn't uh, have to do anything with the tuba. But then when we went through security, they actually changed the policies. And they said, well, they have to put it through the scanner. Uh, so it's not possible to that they just take a look at it and make a drug test and say, okay, it's good, they can, uh, you can go. But it doesn't fit through the scanner because it's way too big. So um, they made an exception, but they took it with them in, I think, a special lab or something. So we had to wait an extra 10 minutes, and um, our flight only started boarding when uh, my mom arrived with the tuba. So it was very stressful because uh, the plane could have left without us, and that would have been very bad because then we had we would have had uh, to take a train, which would have not been very very fast or comfortable um, so we were lucky with this and obviously because it is very fra fragile you have to book another seat Things we were lucky with this and obviously because it is very fra fragile you have to book another seat um, because if you put it into the uh, where the, where the other uh, luggage goes down at the bottom of the plane it will either get smashed um, or you have to buy a big hard case, which is also very expensive, and there might still be a chance of it uh, getting broken. And you don't want that if you go somewhere and you have to play a concert the next day or go to a competition. So uh, we booked a seat. That was actually pretty chill. But uh, you know, you put the tuba in the seat and sit next to the tuba. Um, but you still have to be careful because uh, obviously if people sit in front of the, of the tuba and decide to lean back they could actually smash the tuba and then your tuba is broken too so uh, you have to be uh, you have to be very careful and just pay attention so now we are in Berlin uh, the weather is pretty cloudy but uh, we're still gonna go out uh, explore a bit and uh, just look around the city Everybody. That is right, today is the next day and it's concert day. Um, I'll be getting some breakfast in a minute and uh, then I will go to the rehearsal. I just finished breakfast and now it's time for the rehearsal. So we're just gonna go to the Philharmonie and then I'll uh, play a bit and then I'll have the rehearsal and then we'll come back to the hotel. Got everything? Let's go. Seems like the weather isn't that bad after all. Wow. Look at this.
Yo, what's up guys? So we just finished the uh, um, rehearsal, the final rehearsal. It's a great hall, a lot of fun. And uh, now we're gonna go and explore the city. This is actually the last uh, one from 18 um, gates standing in Berlin. At the top of the Quadriga. Hello, it's 1530, so we got a couple of hours left till the concert. Uh, I'm starting my preparation phase, not my preparation phase. So basically, always before I have a concert or a competition, I like to do these things to calm me down, to get me ready, to get me into the mindset. First one is, uh, you know, eat something, have a good meal. I just have that downstairs in the restaurant. And second of all is uh, I'm going to sleep a bit. I want to have a nap or at least try to get a nap. Uh, helps you relax, of course, and you know, get ready because if you already had a long day, it's not good if you're tired in the evening and you have to play a concert or even go to a competition. So, I do like to do that. Then, I uh, like to shower, um, get fresh again, feel, feel better, feel better. And then, I get into the clothes and then we just go there. I play a bit, and uh, that's basically it. And then, I just play the competition and then finished and uh, I think it's, that's it's very important that you have a ritual or at least some things that you do uh, before you play so you feel better and uh, I'm going to show you guys uh, what these things are and give you a little perspective my preparation routine starts with a nap uh, I recommend about one to one and a half hours so you don't get too tired, but you still get a good rest. After that, it's time for a shower. And then I just put on my concert clothes and shoes. When it rains, I take the shoes with me so they don't get dirty. And that's basically my three-step routine. It gets me into the mood and mindset ready for a concert or the competition.
Bravo. Bravo!
<laughs> nein, stop. What is up, YouTube? We are back. And I'm tired. Success. It was a success. It was a great night. I played very good. I'm happy with myself. I met some new people. Uh, always good to meet new people, to uh, get to know more people and to make connections, which is very important, not only in music, but uh, generally everywhere in life. It's important to make connections, to make friends. And uh, yeah, I'm very happy and uh, we'll go eat something. And uh, yeah, and then I'm very happy and everything, but tomorrow's, like they say, tomorrow's Monday. So, um, work starts again. So, um, actually, after tomorrow, I have uh, my competition in Basel. But I'm not gonna complain because I chose this. You know, I, I, I chose to do this. So, we're just gonna go through it like we went through with this one. And I'm excited, and I'm excited to uh, do this. And I'm gonna take you guys with me again. And uh, I'm gonna show you guys everything, you know, like, you think guys do. Um, competition, concert, they're very close together, but also very far apart, in different aspects and different visions. So, without further ado, let's have some fun, let's have some good food. Definitely gonna come back to do some sightseeing because uh, I didn't really get the chance to see much because uh, I was busy with the concert. But um, yeah, now we're on our way back home. Berlin, we're heading back home. 